here. And this is why it is difficult to have conversations and debates with people who are dishonest. That's true. Which usually is a lot of atheists. Yeah. So the bottom line is I categorically showed him that his claim that the law of non-contradiction is universally true in virtue that it has never been shown to be false. I demonstrated to him five times why that's a fallacy. And he just simply continues to want to play word games. Was he not warned several times? Yes, he was. Yeah, he, he was. Continued. Yeah. So he got ejected. True, true. I, uh, mm, Dart, I do have a question, man. Um, when it comes to the you know rational approach of understanding these worldviews, um, how do you um, measure your worldview? You know, in, in using the model of empiricism. Say that again. Yeah, how do you, you know, measure your model against, you know, the model of empiricism? How do I measure the Christian model of reality against what? Empiricism. Empiricism is self-refuting. Um, what's your? You're Can not you aware. This? You're not aware that empiricism is self-refuting. Oh, no, I don't think so. Maybe you can teach. Empiricism is the position that the only beliefs that are worthy of accepting or believing in are those that are confirmed or verified by empirical endeavors. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's experience. Now, how is that statement confirmed by empirical endeavors? Um, because it is not propositional. It is phenomenon. Ph phenomenon. Like no, no, no. Listen, listen. That's not an answer to my question. How is the following statement verified empirically? Here's the statement. The only things that are worthy of belief are those things that have been verified by empirical endeavors. Well, it is verified in virtue of its, um, you know, uh, ref um, I, I guess reflection, not reflection, but um, correspondence with reality. Oh, okay, okay. Listen, you're giving me, listen to me. You're giving me a vegetable soup of gobbledygook. Now, no, 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 no. what empirical endeavor, and please be specific, what empirical sure. endeavor verified the following statement? The only things that are worthy of belief are those things that have been verified by empirical endeavors. Mm -hmm. okay. Who never verified that statement? Yeah, of course. So if uh, you know, you're going to use you know, an idea and that idea can be Sir, verified. Stop talking right now or I'm going to kick can you. Be, why? Stop talking or you will be kicked. Now, you are not addressing my question. You are giving me a gobbledygook response. I'm not going to have you waste my time. Now, what empirical endeavor verified the statement? If you don't address a specific empirical endeavor, then don't bother speaking. What empirical endeavor did you have in mind? The correlation uh, of reality. What empirical endeavor? Ideas are supposed to be used uh, for what something. What empirical endeavor did you have in mind? What do you mean? Uh, no, I don't think. Do you I'm know what an empirical endeavor is, sir? I think so, but I might be wrong. Good. You... What empirical endeavor, such as looking through a telescope, looking through a microscope, mm -hmm, okay, mm -hmm. Look, looking at various gauges of things, what empirical endeavor confirmed the following statement? The only things that are worthy of belief are those things that are verified by empirical endeavors. What empirical endeavor did you have in mind? Yeah, the content of that proposition is that ideas are going to be worthy. Okay, last right? chance. No, 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 no. Let what me explain. What empirical endeavor did you yeah. have in mind? Correlation. I am waiting. Okay? I already told you. I, correlation. I, over backwards. I will yeah. give you one more chance. That's a what empirical endeavor? Correlation. 
A philosophical argument is not an empirical endeavor, okay. dude. He's, he's, gone. he's gone. He's been removed from the room. Yeah. By the way, lest any of you think that I'm short-fused, mm -hmm. I'm not. I have dealt with this clown on dozens of previous occasions. He is simply giving gobbledygook responses, which they like to do, making a pretense that they're giving a cogent and relevant response to the question. He, he, mentioned, he mentioned no empirical endeavor. He was asked five times, what empirical endeavor? He kept giving yeah, a he empirical basis for it. Correlation. Right, he was to give a philosophical argument, which is not an empirical. No, he no. didn't. No, he wasn't giving a philosophical. He was giving gobbledygook. An empirical endeavor would be like looking through a, a magnifying glass, looking through a telescope. Right, or testing it in a Bunsen burner. Um, so. Pulling out a um, tape measure. Yeah, putting it in a big uh, Yeah, looking at a Geiger counter. Okay. Now, he was asked five times, what empirical endeavor did you have in mind? And each and every time, he had no answer to it. So rather than say, well, I have none, he just wanted to give a gobbledygook response. Okay?